it you know that she's written into me as well. Did you know that? Yes. I, I would have never, I wouldn't be here if it weren't for her. I'm a very private person. I don't want all of you to know my business, but I would do anything, doctor, anything to get her the help that she needs. Here's what she said. Quote, our family has just been going downhill for years. 15, going downhill for years. So she's talking about back to very young age. She says, nothing we have done has worked. She says, I'm 15 years old. I was eight when I was sent to my first hospital for mental health. I was sent to long-term treatment at 14. Everything was good for a few months. All of us pretending everything was okay and pretending we're happy was fake. My only happy place is on my phone and with my boys. Recently, I've gotten in trouble from the law for sending provoking pictures out for money. I made $1,800. I had 11,000 followers on Instagram, and that was my whole life until my mom shut it down. I talked to older guys as in 18 years old, which I know is not right. But at the time I'm talking to them, I don't care. I want to get out of this pattern, talking to boys, smoking, drinking, fighting. I know the family has given up on me. We need help making our family normal again, Dr. Phil. That's a 15 year old saying, I know I'm heading down the wrong road. I know I'm self-destructing here. I don't know what to do. That's, I hope she's sincere this time. I think she is, she's never. She did write it down, yeah. I mean she. That's why I'm here. That's why I agreed to it. She wrote into an abyss. I mean, she has no idea if it's ever going to be read. Okay. She has no idea if I'm ever going to see it. You got to give her credit for that. I do. I, I believe that she's had mm -hmm. enough also. I think she's finally to the, she's tired of living the way that we live also. I think she's sincere this time.